Um, uh, hey guys, today I just become my hacked account. So, I fell for these things, like, really badly, that's like, um, uh, it's like called, I want you to give like, so much Robux and I have to get the password. Do not trust these people. Why? Because they might hack you. Yes, I know, we might be like super cool and stuff. You even might be the opposite gender of the, of the guy hacking you. But still, he wants to hack you because you're famous, rich, whatever. God. And so I fell for those things and then I, and then I checked my email, like, I, I took all of my emails and then. From this to this, but then I recovered it because I just clicked that fucking look. Yeah, now that is a hacker recovery. Note, note everybody, do not trust anybody that says, I want to give you like so many Robux, but I have to, but I can't, so I have to get you like, get your password like, he only wants to hack you. Understood anybody? I swore to him that he that he would not if that he would not hack me. But he did. I knew it. Yes, I knew it everybody. I I knew it. He hacks. He thinks he's cool. But he's actually happy. That damn bitch. Anyway. If you want to go a place, like, seriously. He almost happy. me. If, if I weren't that noticeable and just checked off almost all of my emails on whatever emails or whatever thingy, then he would have hacked me anyway. But he didn't. Because I did that. I actually wasn't ignored. Yes, if this was an if this was a noob account and my other account was ODC, I wouldn't care anyway. I mean who wants a noob account? Seriously. Ugh. But hacking on ABC, I knew that's gonna happen. Because I am fucking a because I'm badass. If you think you can hack me, think again. Because I'm even not falling for your fucking tricks. Even if you say I, you give me like so much robot and it's not a scam. And I had a really bad feeling about this. Why? Because so much god damn it. For like two fucking years, I played this fucking game, and I was oh, and I'm over a month be OBC all like, this. and it's not even a start of my OBC. It's the little start of my OBC. Anyway, if you want to do something that you would, wait, I am a friend of Winners, so yay for me, I can actually make this perfect place. Awesome. Yes, that is awesome. Oh, classic blue. Oh, oh, that is like so awesome. I'll go stream that because, well, I'm cream. Duh. Anyway, so you had tail style over there, so yeah. Cream doll is actually fan made. Jerk. 
any other character doll than other than Tails' doll is Batman. You might ask, why is not Tails doll fan made? Why? Because Sega made it. It's it's his ultimate mistake to make it. So he only made the doll character and, and doll character once. Except so well when you actually yes, it isn't in the enemies or anything, it's just a fan. It's just a fan made stuff and yeah. It even might be in a crazy pasta like really. Might be. Like Tails' Nightmare 2 or and Tails', and Tails Nightmare. Yeah, that's two examples. Yes? Wanna know what what Tails doll's actions wanna be? Kill them all, bitch. Kill them all. Why kill them all? Because it's a murder, God. Well, since fans love Tails doll, they decide make them all. So they make Sonic, Knuckles, whatever. A lot. Sonic XC is an original creepy pasta. Probably the first one, I guess. Like from Sonic 1 or something, I guess. Yeah, it's something from the art original series. It's not Tails Doll. Seriously. Tails Doll isn't the first creepypasta they made. Sonic.exe is. Because. Because. Um, Wow, Tails doll. It's really. Warning, do not enter the dark room if you have weak nerves. And you see what's there? Tails doll. Of course. So Tails doll is just a creepy pasta. Hey, why do you think a doll is creepy? Since it no, you know, earlier than that, from like um, Mad Farther, I guess, maybe. Anyway, it was made in like two thousand and I mean two 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 thousand. And it was only nine while um, Gary was an adult. And I don't know what Mary's age was. But she was a painting, so I don't know. It was nine years old when she when when they made when they made Ib. Ib was nine years old. Or the main character was nine years old. And take a look at a nine year old being scared by a fucking horror game. Hey, how? How do you. I mean, a horror effect experience. Why, you might ask? Because she's a kid. She was a kid when this was made. And it was a gallery. It was in a gallery named well, Georgina, I guess. Well, this the the, ar the artist was created was the artist's name was Georgina. Georgina. And in the new Ib versions, there's also an ending. As you finally play fucking Mary for the fucking millionth time I guess for 13 goddamn years like really I don't know but I finally discovered it in 2014 of course so I don't know 
But when I found out this game was actually made in 2000, so 2001, so I guess. I don't know. Ip, Ip was a girl. She was nine years old and she had two parents. She had her mother and father. They all went to the to the gallery. Her, Ip had a handkerchief with her before she went to, to the gallery with her parents. She looks at a big. She looks at a biggest painting in the in the whole um, in the whole gallery. Whole ga gallery, whole gallery, whole gallery. There we go. And then, then when she like, and then the lights go out. It goes a little darker for you to see. And then boom, everyone's gone. Yes, you might freak out like, oh my god, what the, where the hell is everybody? And I'm like. Um, uh, I'm also creating a little new series of role-playing, like, ah. One day, one day I have to go to the scariest dark room ever. But that's, like, gonna be never new to play because I have weak nerves, okay? I have really weak nerves. Because, um... If I look at a roof, I, I get like raffle off and, and uh, roll off the floor being like super scared and, and, and then stay away from the doll for all eternity. Case closed, okay? Dolls are scary when they're bloody knives, okay? You have learned that dolls are scary than when they have knives because they're nerve murderers. Oh. When you haven't played game with this this girl is here, you may you might wonder, who the fucking hell is this girl? Well, in in a game in the Nintendo game yeah. They had a Sonic ro roleplay game, and they would, it was all like robots and stuff, like yeah. Really. Anyway, so um, the game was all about Sonic and Mini and Knuckles and the guys of Sonic, whatever, fighting um robots. Duh. Oh yeah, does that actually seem familiar? Yes, Eggman. But no, that isn't Eggman in this game. It is Shade, the master of the all. And they kind of look like Chaos, but really too. Oh yeah, Chaos Zero. <laughs> okay, I guess you might see me next time in next game. Probably next episode, I guess. Okay, anyway, even though, even though I, I want to get the series up ahead, but I need, oh, I need some players, so, if you want to join the old play, I guess you can say so. Also, I am from Norway, and the time might, and if you know that, you might be online by now. Seriously. And yes, goodbye guys, see you next.